How's it going everybody? Daniel here, you're watching Danimal Tech and today I'm going to show you guys something that can pretty much save your life and that is how to remove a forgotten passcode or password of your iDevice. It could be an iPhone, an iPad, an iPod Touch, uh, any any iPad or iPod, whatever. It could be a really old iPad like this one, which is the first version, or it could be the newest, the, I, the iPad 4. The same thing with, with the iPhone and the iPod Touch and running every firmware. From the first firmware until now, this is a valid method, and I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure this is still going to work with the future versions. Right now, uh, it, it still works with the 6.1, and I'm on, almost 100% sure it's still going to work far beyond. All right? <clears throat> so, uh, in order to do it, you need to have uh, your computer, you need to have iTunes, Make sure to have it on the latest version because it's always it always works better with the latest version. Sometimes if it's an old version of the of the iTunes, it cannot it may not work. So make sure to have it updated, and uh, that's basically it. Uh, one more thing before I can start is that make sure to do it with your own device. All right, a device that you've forgotten, either password. Don't do it with uh, with a, a stolen or or some device that you found in the street or something. All right, so I'm not responsible for that. So. Uh, what you need, we're gonna need to do is turn it off, all right? So let's go to the first screen, turn it off normally. Turn off, let's just wait, and that's it. And then hold the home button, just that. You don't need to hold any other button. You don't need to put into DFU mode, it's just a restore mode. So hold this button down, and while doing that, you're gonna put your device in the restore mode as I just said. Make sure you have iTunes opened on your computer. So keep holding, it's gonna open the Apple logo and as you see uh, it's on restore mode. Now let me just put the camera closer and as you guys can see you can already release the home button and put your device to the side. Alright? So right now you have the computer, you can see everything that's going on right here. So uh, iTunes detected your iPad in recovery mode. That's it. So OK, restore iPad. That simple. You're gonna need. Uh, before I can start, let me let me let me show you guys that. Uh, let me tell you actually that you're gonna lose all the information you have in your device. All right. But if if it is synced to iTunes, you can after doing that you can sync it back and uh, and plug it back and sync all the information, all the music, all the contacts. If not, if it's not synced to iTunes or iCloud. I'm sorry, you're gonna lose. You're gonna lose everything. But this is the only method. So it's better to have a blank uh, iPad than not an iPad at all. So restore iPad. You're gonna need to download the firmware. I think I have already downloaded this firmware right here. So restore an update. I already have it. So that's why it's saying extracting extracting software instead of downloading. And then that's basically it. Uh, after extracting, it's going to run the process of restoring. You don't need to do anything else. Everything is going to be done by iTunes and your device. Right? So that's it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks a lot. And make sure to like this video down below as well as subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate that. And I see you guys in my next video. Bye bye.